We are in the Roadshow Kitchen this morning. Thanks to Go Providence. Jeff Shabo is here. Lux Burger is the place. When I'm making just any burger, it is the TB12 Burger. It's all part of the Build Your Own Burger contest that's going to happen this Saturday. Everyone is welcome to come, and it really is a lot of fun. How are you? Doing well. How are you? I look forward to this event every year. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. This is my first time being able to be a part of it, so it's going to be a good time. So when we're talking bur burgers, mm -hmm. we're not just taking uh, taking a piece of hamburger and tossing it in between a bun oh, or no. something like that. No. It's a whole thing that goes on. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So we have our final five of our seventh annual Build Your Own Burger contest. So we have four that we did prepare right. so everyone can see. And then the one we're featuring today is uh, probably going to be a big favorite, is the TB12 burger. And you want to do this one right in honor of Tom Brady. Absolutely. So what are the ingredients that we need to put this together? So what we have here is our horseradish mayo, excuse me, wasabi mayo. All these so that's going to have a little kick, right? Yeah, absolutely. We have a little bacon jam. We have some goat cheese, a little play on words if you get it. Mm -hmm. uh, caramelized <laughs> onions, little ripe tomatoes, shredded lettuce. And we have five bare batted onion rings. <laughs> so if you take a guess, for the five Super Bowl uh, championships that Tom Brady has. I can tell you, whoever did this is pretty pretty creative. With That's this. Mr. Brad Conley, so good yeah, job, Brad. He did a great job. The other thing, obviously, you can have all of this stuff at home, but you want a decent, uh, great meat to actually Correct. make the burger itself. Yes. And that's one of the things Lux Burger is known for. And that's the biggest part of the contest itself, is the meat we choose, even on a daily basis. So we have our gold label Hereford beef, uh, which Three out of the five uh, feature that. And some, some may say, well, does it really make a difference when you've got all of the ingredients? Mm. Yes. yes. It makes a huge mm -hmm. difference, and you can really taste the difference. Correct. Even the bun, too. Even the bun itself, which you always need a great bun, too. All right, so we'll put this together. We will talk about the contest, and we don't want to leave them out. The other burgers that are here that are going to be part of this contest happening Saturday afternoon, and you are welcome to attend. Back to you. Nothing to get scared out about here. This, uh, we are in the Roadshow Kitchen. Lux Burger Bar is a place. Talking about the uh, the big contest that's going to happen this weekend. Build your own burger contest. Starts at what time? 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Everybody's welcome. If you love burgers, these aren't your run-of-the-mill burgers. People have thought about what they're going to put on. They are delicious hamburgers. We're going to put one together uh, right now. Absolutely. So, with over 500 submissions, mm -hmm. you know, the capability of having over 400,000 ingredients, We'll throw this on a bit, okay, sure. smoke us yep, out. Yep. Um, we went through our final five. Very tedious to figure out who we want to put in there. Um, but like last year, we had the Rhode Islander, which is a big influence locally. But I think this one, New England in general, will be a big one Okay. Uh, with the TB12 burger. So we have our gold label Hereford beef. And when that's really a key. When you go to Lux Burger Bar, you know you're going to get a great tasting, Absolutely. Uh, great tasting burger. A little caramelized onions. Mm -hmm. We're going to get those down. Got that sweet taste to it. And then come for the voting phase, you know, we're being creativity, edibility, um, just the name of the burger. So I think TB12 is very recognizable sure. uh, for some people, I guess. <laughs> um, but you're going to be blown away when you actually see all the burgers. You get to taste some when you come outside. So it's going to be a great time. And I know we're talking about the hamburgers, but when you do go to Lux Burger Bar, when the contest is going, you have great French fries, which is yes. a key. Yes. If you're going to have a good burger, you need good French fries Always. to go along with it. They can usually do some uh, burger bling, mm -hmm. a little uh, cheese on there if you want, some bacon, jalapenos. Which is all, which is nice. When you go to the restaurant, you can pick mm -hmm. out the different things. How long should this cook? You don't want to overcook a great hamburger. So depending on how you like it, we're going to cook ours about to medium today. Mm -hmm. um, is Brendan trying this one out again? Uh, he is going to try okay. it, not today, but he will try it this weekend. Right. So I think about, he's, uh, he's going to join, join yeah. us on Saturday. All right, so 10 minutes for that, so we'll let that sizzle away. We'll go over the other uh, the other burgers, too, and show give you a little preview of what the contest is going to look like this Saturday at Lux Burger Bar. Back to you. Sizzle you here is a burger from Lux Burger. TB12 Burger is what we're putting together. Jeff Shabo is, joins us this morning. Thanks to our friends at Go Providence. We are wrapping things up. Look at that burger. That is good. What, what, do you, what kind of cheese on that? So we got some goat cheese on mm -hmm. there. That is nice. Greatest of all time in uh, Tom Brady land. So. Tom Brady land. So let's review what we have here. You got it. Let's so go we have our lettuce, our ripe tomatoes, mm -hmm. caramelized onions. So we have our burger. Beautiful goat cheese right there. Now we have our bacon jam. If you want to get a good look at that one right there. Now here's the tricky part. We're going to take our five onion rings. <laughs> our wasabi look, I'm mayo. I'm going to try to bite into this thing. How, does, how is that going to happen? Good luck. <laughs> Now that's that a down. burger. Huh? That is a burger. 
almost as big as our Frankenstein challenge now, at Lux God Burger. knows I love this burger, and I know it's called the TB12 burger. Tom Brady will probably never <laughs> Probably not. I'm pretty sure that's not in his diet book. That is not in that diet no. book at all. All right. So... We've got the burger. Talk, tell us about the burger contest, and I'm trying Absolutely. to go. I'm going to like work this and see if we can figure out how to so do this. So, burger contest is this Saturday at 2 p.m. Lux Burger Bar, uh, Five Memorial Boulevard. Mm -hmm. And over the past month, we've had people voting online through our Facebook, as well as our Lux uh, website, luxburgerbar.com/slash/byobcontest. So, the top votes, along with the top sales in the restaurant, and then the judges' votes, will ultimately pick our winner. So right. for a year, you'll have your menu, uh, your, excuse me, your burger on the menu, as well as $1,000 in prizes split up between everybody. And there have been a bunch, like you said, a bunch Absolutely. of different burgers. Um, we have some of the other, the other contestants, the other Correct. burgers yep. here. So what kind do you got? So we're going to start right over here. We have our BAM, which is going to be some lean bison, aged cheddar pulled pork, smoked bacon, mac and cheese, iceberg lettuce, barbecue sauce, <laughs> fatty style, which is uh, our grilled cheese buns. With some bacon in between, just for good measure. Sure. We're going to have our El Jefe, uh, some Gold Label Hereford, queso, chicharrones, iceberg lettuce, guacamole, mango habanero salsa. And then we're going to go up to the Figgy Piggy, which is one of my personal favorites. What's that? So we're going to have some Gold Label Hereford once again. Uh, we're going to have some provolone, crispy prosciutto, uh, roasted red peppers, and fig jam. Awesome, awesome burger. And then uh, this time of the year, I think it's very fitting, Dirty Pilgrim. So we have some lean turkey, <laughs> pepper jack, smoked bacon, the some rosemary thing. stuffing, cranberry chutney, coleslaw, horseradish mayo, and of course on a sesame bun. On a sesame bun. So all of this will be uh, will be part of the uh, part of the contest on Saturday. Where mm -hmm. a bunch of us are going to going to be there on Saturday. They'll bring out these burgers one by yep. one. We fill out our card. We have some something to drink. We have some great French fries while Absolutely. we're there. It's just a fun atmosphere. And you can come. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Our burger just fell over. You can come by and just hang out with us, sample some of this stuff, try some of this stuff out, and and get a look at all of these great burgers up close. Go for it. I'm going to go for it, squish. but I'm going to have to give it like a... Give it a little lean. I may have to like sit... Uh, all right, so I'm going to lean, in, lean on it. this. I think that may be more manageable. So you'll be there. Brendan I'll, will be there. Right. Becca Burger from Hot 106. With a name like Becca Burger, she needs to she needs to be <laughs> there. I think that was a given. She's going to be there. member Dan Nichols mm -hmm. and our maestro, Mr. John L.K. Mr. John, okay. I believe it's National Boss Day. <laughs> Mike, is that correct? <laughs> All right, I'm Happy going Happy National Boss Day. Happy National Boss So I'm going to, I'm squishing this in. We've got five <laughs> onion rings. I don't even know. All right. <laughs> That's a good lean right there, though, right? Wow. Hmm? That's pretty good. <laughs> wow. Hmm. You're going to have to talk, and I can't. I think so. So as you can see here, Will's enjoying this TB12 wow. burger. Mm. Uh, so we really encourage everybody to come out this week. Follow us on our Instagram, our Facebook. That. Come out and vote. Dude, that is a good burger. Tasty, huh? It's really tasty. Mm -hmm. You can really taste. I know there's a lot of things on here, and people mm -hmm. will probably say, how can you taste everything that's on there? But you really can. And the goat cheese that's on top. Yep, goat along cheese with has the, a nice touch to it. A little that, spice from the wasabi, yeah. some crunch from those onion rings. Along with that bacon jam, really, really mm -hmm. adds a great, great taste. So here's to you. Thanks for coming in today. Thank you, as always. Always great burgers. Come out and join us on uh, on Saturday afternoon. If you love a good burger, if you want to know how to make this, we'll post a link on our website, roadshow.com. Mm -hmm. I'll go.